Yeah. I'm glad I didn't have to buy all her sisters. I don't care. Oh my gosh. The articulated knee and the awesome fin. Oh, she's stunning. Wow. Oh, yes. I love the fabric tail. It's so beautiful. I hope it straightens out. Oh, I don't want to rip it. I love the knee. And the fabric top is so beautiful. Those elastics that are holding the top will disintegrate over time. Yes, Mermy. Mermy, Mermy, Mermy. Yeah. Oh. There we go. I love that they kept the paint job from the original single doll with the clippable tail. The fabric piece, I love the printing so much. And this little meshy accent but it does curl unfortunately and that will and does happen <sighs> i love the locks with the hair mix i just the hairline is a little clumped but that's okay the face sculpt is gorgeous i love the fabric top as well it's a beautiful beautiful fabric I love the color mixture she's beautiful i'm so excited here's the comparison of the two same similar paint job this one has no oh. this one has a tail piece that comes out but it's absolutely impossible to pull out so i wouldn't try breaking the doll but the only articulation she has is at the the waist or the, i mean the, the crotch and the shoulders and the head like the face sculpt is similar and so is the hair for the articulated one but this one also has a molded on top, which I absolutely hate. The thin waistline is painted for this one. And for this one, it is like a clear plastic. I didn't care for the sisters because I felt that their thin pieces were not detailed enough. For this one, it is just so detailed with like the veins and the uh, blending colors like it's just so elegant and so royal and it actually is just captivating from the movie for a doll form i love her she's so beautiful what are your thoughts you guys i'd love to know thanks for watching